The audience has uh, been asked who they think would be a good choice, and various names came up. Um, uh, one of them was, of course, Vivek Ramaswamy. Yeah. He's made a big splash. Ron DeSantis, who's made in, making an appearance today in South Carolina, we just found out. Um, obviously, Tim Scott, Byron Donalds, and a, a big uh, presence here for Tulsi Gabbard. Um, very interesting. Um, our, and Christy Nome as well, I should say. Right. Our, our, are they all on your short list? They are. Honestly, all of those people are good. They're all good. They're all solid. And I always say, I want people with common sense. He's a fantastic guy, and he's really, uh, he's got something that's uh, very special because he started off with a Zippo, and he's got, he ended up very strong. He did a great job. I was actually surprised when he called because he was doing well, and uh, it's an honor to have his endorsement. He's going to be working with us, and he'll be working with us for a long time.
I feel no need to kiss the ring. I have no fear of Trump's retribution. I'm not. I'm not looking for anything from him. My own political future is of zero concern. So I hear what the political class says, but I hear from the American people too. Some people used to say I was running because I really wanted to be vice president. I think I've pretty well settled that question. Well, I settled it about three months ago. <laughs> and look, it's, uh, she's not working. She's here. She's down by 30, 35 points. And everybody knows her. You're not supposed to lose your home state. Shouldn't happen anyway. And she's losing it bigly.